Hello everyone, Ishma here. Get a crew to find out, scout. So, yeah, well, our navigator got kidnapped. Gotta find him, but uh, let's, yeah, have a look around this district completely before we start worrying about that. I mean, I'm sure he can hold out for a couple more minutes, right? The Freljord family is everything. Everyone always together. For survival. Here, it is very different. People come here from all over the world, and they usually come alone. But where are the new families? People coming together in a harsh land, gathering around the fire with newfound friends. <laughs> you got a lot to learn about Bilgewater. Seems kind of naive, to be honest. <laughs> Hey, hey, what? What? I what? don't scare. I don't tire. Where did these I guys come from? Stop. What the hell just happened? I have bad. Uh, keep stepping out on her. Oh, of course you didn't hit the stealth one. That'd be way too easy. But honestly, where did these guys come from and why are we fighting them and what even is going on? on the mother serpent. Uh, no. You're just target practice. Running out of speed. That's right, don't they? It's gonna be a waste, but I'd rather get rid of him. fight but to be fair that kind of surprised me so yeah are there gonna be more enemies around here yeah oh they are you know who I am. at least this time they aren't Does that hurt? Waste of ammo. 
Fight him. Another one down. Bye bye. That's how we do it. You will stagnate no longer. Give it away are the enemies around here. I mean, should it really be rust actually? The herring could have destroyed Bill Troll the last time it did. Seems to me they're becoming more frequent too. I'm gonna stick around for the next one. There's a razor fin that is strangely docile. Looks approachable. Get it! No, oh, who's a good one? Who's a good one? You're a good one. See, you've met Professor Gilly. What? You saw this any stranger. Just not to other Razorfin. I her all alone when she was wee pep, but she didn't hiss or attack me. Bottle fed until she got older, and this is the result. Now, I couldn't get rid of her even if I wanted to. Ha ha ha. Okay, more treasure down there, but probably also more danger. No. Okay. And I told you the story of how I found my shield? You said it involved a mountain troll. Yes, it was a good troll. But the mountain, it was disagreeable. I had to punch it. Of course you did. Are they flirting? Kinda of sounds like they're floating. Sailor's jacket. Guess I know what that goes on. Uh, I guess. Thona, the Bladebreaker sent the new stash up a Slamfish Cove. When you get this note, hang a red jacket in your window. Then leave the Trice Drowned to the spot while you want the Bladebreaker so that the Trice Drowned are coming. Hopefully the bastards will kill each other off. Kai, Mikov, and the others will be waiting to clean up the survivors and take the loot. Uh, I wonder if that outcome is going to happen. Who would think of winning a head to head battle? Fortune or Gangplank? I mean, it's on Gangplank. Fortune is youth, but Gangplank has firepower. My brother says Fortune would win because he's got two guns. Gangplank's gun is bigger. It's always about the size of the gun, isn't it? Bet a silver kraken for every time Gangplank said he was going to fix up this dock. At least have three silver krakens. Almost enough for a gold kraken to think about it. Okay. If you say so. Can't tell me Gangplank is really dead. Them just so eyes, then what does it believe? That man's will is iron. Would have kept him alive when the rest of us would have died. Can I get these vases? Somehow. Huh? Ah. I had it there for a moment. This is tricky. Back in the old gangplank days, the city was worse, if you can believe it. In the gangplank days, you could hardly go black without seeing blood on the cobbles. These days, folk comes with blows over nothing, but it could be worse. It could always be worse. I mean, he's not wrong, but... Meh. I guess we could go in there. I mean, I don't yet know why I would want to, but I guess we'll find that out in a moment. Jeff Doll's cookbook, Coconut Hackfish. The Coconut Hackfish, delicious combination of crunchy fried coconut exterior and chewy rich hackfish underneath. Can be served with a sweet chili sauce or his famous salt sauce for dipping. Rare hackfish by cleaning, skinning, and deboning the hackfish. Be sure to rinse thoroughly at each stage and as needed, as fish exudes a viscous 
a viscous mucus layer constantly. Chop meat into large bites. In a dish, crack three seagull eggs and mix. Another dish, stir together one part flour, one part shredded coconut, one part hard tack crumbs, a spoon or two of salt and pepper. Coat fish chunks in egg and then a dry mixture, setting aside. Heat a skillet of cooking oil deep, deep enough to fry. Cook chunks on oil until golden brown, turning them sometimes. Remove chunks and dry on a cloth. Catfish can be used instead of hackfish if needed. Is it me or am I getting hungry? Place of rest for the weary. Uh, no. I don't need that, thank you. Alright. So let's see if we can find these other guys now. Uh, I think I hadn't talked to you. The dapper cell looks lost in thought daydreaming. There are marks on his nose that indicate he might have been wearing reading glasses earlier. Takes a deep breath. Funny how smells can recall memories from years ago. Look as if he was some business with me. Did glass I Joe send you? So he must be Lin. That would be me. I take you have something with me as well. Uh, the book. Excellent. I was wondering where that book went, he says. Well, with this in hand, I assume Glasses Joe is waiting for me. I'll head over now, he says as he takes off. Okay, that was the first one. Swatch is okay, but Ganker was born a reaver. He was killing and stealing when we were in nappies. Thora, I'm sorry. I thought you probably would be able to handle a blade better. Cape went down fighting. I returned to the waters and said a prayer to Nagarpuros like he'd want. I know it's been the news, but the plan worked. The tribes drowned and the blade breakers cut each other up bad. Your brother wasn't the only one to die. So I've shared loot for you. Can't make up for anything, but it can help me get your family through this war. You've been good bosses to me, and good friends. Get in touch, and I'll give you both your cuts. Sorry. Ah, uh, well. Gang wars, huh? Claim you don't like to dance, but I saw you doing a jig at the Wiggling Eel last night. You're pretty good, to be honest. Thanks, but I have too much inhibition to really let myself be free. Hey, all kinds of crazy noises come from that house behind me. I ain't seen a lady that lives there come out in ages. I see some jagged hooks coming by looking for her now and then. It looked like they was in a dangerous mood. Okay, so that is probably the next thing where we have to go. So let's leave that there for just a moment. Hello. Oh, they are probably the jagged hooks, huh? These dudes that we've been fighting here. Careful. I mean, it even says really. though jagged hooks run and blade. Well, guess we just want to read. Might, might be this guy. Getting through these fights quicker, but not as well rested, I'm gonna say. 
Jeff Charles cookbook, forward. Finally convinced Charles to let me transcribe some of his recipes. Took some doing. I'll be working extra shifts at the kitchen for weeks. But finally I'll be able to snap open that grumpy crawdad's mind and write something down. He promised not to leave anything out either, as long as I bring him grog at each sitting. I had to sign a contract that I wouldn't publish the recipe so open my own restaurant until he's dead, but he's mostly large and smokes like a chimney, so it shouldn't have to wait too long. I'll have to make sure to ask him for the following recipes. Coconut hackfish, prawn pralines, bilge rice, hot brine, and his mysterious salt sauce. I can't wait! Well, I found a couple of these so far. Oh, hello there. Did they just throw explosives at me? That's rude. Think you can handle me? should do now that I think about it probably get this I still think we're mostly going to heal with her. Oh! And another one. Little bastard. Are you worthy? Getting through another fight this way. Perhaps this place could use some more 
furnishings. Got any ideas? I was thinking perhaps a mountain here, and some snow all around there. Sure, just put a mountain there. It's nothing. Heck, dude. And then ring. Uh, nope. Nope. Maybe. I mean, eight attack power isn't that much, is it? not do that okay I think we should definitely take a rest before we uh, go into the warehouse there but before we do even that let's make sure we actually have collected everything around here that we can looks like we did well you know except from the warehouse obviously Finish up that side quest and then take a rest at the inn and then we'll go under the warehouse. We just gotta make our way over back here and up the elevator. And you are probably slim. A large man sounds lazy in a noisy street. On his shirt, there are stains from no less than three different sources of food and drink, as if he were engrossed in his feedings. Accuracy was of no concern. A bit tiny one, aren't you? Well, everyone's tiny compared to me, he grunts. That be me. That got something for me then, eh? I can smell it on you, he says, looking in your direction. Good rations. As the rations leave your hands, Sloop stuffs them directly into his mouth and swallows without chewing. Well, I guess I got better bed to bless you, I Joe. It's got more food, I bet, he says and leaves. Wasn't he able, uh, supposed to take the rations for the others as well? Oh, well. The only is just long at the waters far down below. Sometimes, I wonder what it would be like to be a sea creature. Ever want to stuff like that? Well, it has to be Finn. That's me. Oh, our boss must have sent you, he says. I take it you've also got something else for me. Diving gear. That's the stuff. Diving gear. Oh, baby, now I can really swim with the best of them, he says excitedly. Guess if I head over to Glass Eye Joe then. Peace, he says as he heads off. Okay. Yeah, everybody's here. I see you haven't been directing your duty in the slightest. He crews all return with the items, he says. Answer a sack of coins. As promised. Now over there. 400. Uh, not exactly sure if that was worth it or not. Uh, what's that up there? Is that new? Let's quickly check it out. Uh, oh, it's probably just uh, because of that other quest. Oh, no, because we got it to go to that other place as well. Yeah, 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 I gotcha. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Actually, you know what we could do? First of all, let me have a look at our abilities. And... Uh... Instead of taking that, I think I will actually do this. I'd really like to get that. So why don't I go ahead and do that? And then we can just quickly go to the harbor. First there, because it doesn't cost us any money. And then we go back to the warehouse.
And yes, I know it's only 44 gold pieces or whatever the hell we would need to pay, but you know, 44 gold. It's like gold is growing on trees or anything. I don't know. That it just doesn't work that way. Absolutely does not work that way. Uh, I don't think I have to change uh, check the board. Actually, are there any more rumors? Nope. Okay, let's have a quick rest. And then let's go back. Oh yeah, this is where we have to go next time then. I guess there isn't even a way to get there without using the gondola. I mean, we could have gone there right now, but... Nee. Might as well finish business in the Watchtower District proper. I have to go to another place, right? Am I going the right way? Yeah. There should be another elevator right here. Yeah. All right. And that would be the warehouse where you have to go, so, uh, you know what? Oh, there we go, I had to do that in the next episode, everyone. That should be fine, right? Did a lot of progress this time. <laughs> yeah, not really, it's a bit slow going, but uh, I guess we'll pick up the next episode. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope I see you in the next one. Until then, bye-bye.